what's poppin welcome back to another video for today's video we are gonna get into this flawless my new foundation like everyday makeup routine um shout out to sephora for sponsoring this video all these items you can get at sephora i've been loving my face routine for the last couple days y'all because and y'all i posted a selfie the other day and y'all are like oh my god we need a tutorial we need a tutorial and y'all know i got y'all y'all know i'm always looking out for y'all because i just did like a one-on-one -on -one with a makeup artist and she did my makeup so good i was like girl you need to tell me the tea okay so i'm gonna be showing y'all the items that we picked up from sephora um, because we did like a huge shopping trip at Sephora. So I'm going to show y'all all the items that I have been loving from them. If you're new here, hey girl, my name is Kyra. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you want to see how I got this look and want to get this flawless everyday foundation routine, um, just keep on watching. So let's just hop right into the video. Hey y'all, so let's just get started into the video. This is going to be a video um, that y'all are really excited about because I just recently practiced my my makeup and i posted it on my instagram yesterday and y'all been going nuts y'all been wanting a tutorial because i just took a one-on-one -on -one with a makeup artist she did my makeup for a shoot and it was so good like she did my makeup so good i was like oh my god i need a one-on-one -on -one. she was like okay i got you so we went to chicago and we went to sephora and i got a whole bunch of new makeup i'm so excited and this video is sponsored by sephora and i can't believe it like i can't believe like Sephora is sponsoring this video. I go to Sephora all the time for my makeup products because I go there so much. Sephora has just a lot of essentials that I like, especially like makeup, perfume, a whole bunch of stuff. So I shop there a lot. You can add up points and you can get stuff. So yeah, I would definitely encourage you to be a VIB member. Sephora's holiday savings event is here. If you are a Rouge member, you get 20% off. If you are a VIB member, you get 15% off. And now Beauty Insider, you get 10% off. And y'all know the holidays are here, so it's the perfect time to snag gifts and also time to stock up on your favorite items from Sephora. So all you need to do is use code holiday fun and you can start saving now um it's not a credit card or anything you just are a member of sephora and yeah so i love just going in there and then they always tell me i have a whole bunch of points i'm like oh yes i want that 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 because you get like free gifts and stuff or you can save up for like a bigger prize so and i like that this video is sponsored by them i can't believe it and this wouldn't be possible without y'all so thank y'all so much so we're gonna get into the products that me and and jam picked out and also a few other products i need to show y'all because it's worth the hype we're just gonna get right into it i just primed my face with this smashbox and all the products will be linked down below so this is the primer that i'm using the smashbox photo finish smooth and blur y'all this is a game changer i got the little one just to try it out but i'm gonna go back and get the big one because i'm running out so yeah i just primed my face with that um so yeah, um, one of the tips that Jan gave me was make sure when you're putting on your primer, your face looks matte. I was just putting on my primer just like, like that. And I don't know, like I was doing this all wrong, y'all. When she was giving me the lesson, I was like, oh my God, I'm doing everything wrong. And I just concealed my eyes as well. But I am going to do my brows off camera and I'm going to be taking the Anastasia Brow Wiz in dark brown. And like I said, all the products that I'm using in order will be listed down below. So, yeah, I'm just going to do my brows off camera and we're going to come back and do this face. So, brows are done. They're looking really cute. We're going to go in with the NARS. This, I had to get a new one because obviously it's fall time and I had to just get a new color. And I'm in the color Syracuse. I'm just going to place it on my face. Y'all, I'm so happy I got a new routine. And I wasn't even applying my foundation with a beauty blender before. I was using a brush, a foundation brush. But she was like, no, Kyra, you need to use a beauty blender. And I'm like, okay. Like, all her skills really changed the game for me. And y'all need to go support her. It's crazy how this foundation is my exact color. Like, exact color on point now i'm gonna go in with my concealer this is the dior forever skin corrector in 3wo 
Okay, y'all, so I'm just going to let this sit for like a second. To get the best out of your concealer, you want to let it set in for a little like 30 seconds and then start blending it out. Y'all, and it's crazy how when I took the one-on-one -on -one with her, she taught me about like, like, you know, you for concealer, you want th these to be like your bright areas. So it's crazy. I was really doing this all wrong. It's like crazy to think about. <laughs> I was like, Oh my god and it makes such a huge difference like it's crazy but yeah so i'm just gonna blend this out with a beauty blender and like i was saying y'all like i was not using a beauty blender i was literally just using a brush So now that's all blended out. Now I'm gonna go in with my concealer. This has been my favorite contour concealer. Now I'm gonna go in with a contour. And this has been my favorite contour color. This is in NARS um, and Mendy. Like I said, all the names and stuff will be in the description box. Y'all, like, when it comes to contour, I can do too much and it makes me look very drag queenish. And with my features, it can really take me there. Like, I'm sorry. Like, I gotta be careful when it comes to like makeup and stuff because I can really um, go overboard sometimes and it can be making me look like a man, like a drag. Like, I know it's crazy. So, but yeah, this is like my perfect match. You know, we got to put some on the forehead to make her look non-existent because I already got a big head, so y'all already know. I got to make her look a little small. All right, and then for the size of my face, I'm going to take the beauty blender, but I'm going to go like this to it and then just start blending it in. snatched okay snatched i told y'all we did a huge makeup shopping at sephora and i heard really good things about the lord mercier powder translucent honey and y'all when i tell you i have no i had no under eye creases like none and i'm about to show y'all the trick so this is the tea on like setting your under eyes and stuff jan taught me so first you want to take your brush a little small brush like so and then you want to dip it all in your powder all in there like all in there like all in there okay and then you want to get like a thin layer of it on your brush so you're just going to go in the inner corner first and start just tapping it into your skin okay our under eyes look good no sleep wear okay so now we're gonna bake so i'm just gonna take the beauty blender dap it in brush some of it off and then start in the middle okay so like i said y'all this is literally going to have your face sitting okay that method first thin layer with the brush and then go in and bake with the beauty blender girl so anyway so now we're gonna move to eyes so i've been using this is like one of the best palettes i ever came across of eyeshadow and it's definitely right up my alley with the colors and y'all know how mario makeup by mario was coming this is kim kardashian's makeup artist baby how did you think he was gonna come eyeshadow palette master pat master mats so this has all the colors you will need this is literally like my go-to 
palette right now like it's so good i've been using these two colors right here but these two colors right here because i like my eyeshadow to be dark along with my lashes i'm gonna put y'all on like my everyday like go-to eye so i'm gonna go in with this um lighter brown color right well actually you know i'm gonna try this color out today so i'm gonna go in with this color first On my eyes, y'all, see how, like, brown just enhances, like, it just enhances my eyes. So, I just ended up yep, using this light, and I ended up using this, this brown color right here on my lid. So, now I am going to do liner, wing liner, because we about to be a little extra. So, our face is looking so good, like... So good and we're not even done yet okay so i'm gonna be using a pat mcgrath labs for my liner and this i haven't used it yet but this i needed um a i needed a liner with like a pen like this because i want to try to practice like the inner inner wing but right now i'm not doing all that but i'm gonna see how this works out and I love Pat McGrath Labs. Everything that they create uh, is just bomb. I'm gonna try and hurry up and do like a sample for y'all before my camera just hates on me and gets overheated. But I low key need two hands for this. Okay, so I'm going to do the other eye off camera, and I'll see you on the second to finish our face. Oh my God, y'all. Y'all have to go get this liner. Like, if you always like to do a wing liner, but it's so irritating because of, like, the tip of what you're using, try this out. It's like a pen, um, and it's, it then dries really fast, um, and I'm really impressed. I just um, brushed my lashes, and it did not move at all. So, but yeah, so now we're going to get into the bronzer and like making our face come together. So, um, you want to let your face bake for as long as you can. You're not in a rush. I know sometimes we're rushing when it comes to makeup, but if you don't got to rush, don't rush. Take your time and just let everything just flow. I'm going to be using the Marc Jacobs bronzer on omega omega bronze and tan they only have three colors and this is the dark color and when she used this on me y'all i was so blown away i was like oh my god like this bronzer <sighs> so good uh, this blush I'm telling y'all to go get all these products because they are so good. But y'all know I love brush and this is the NARS Orgasm. I feel like this is like the perfect blush for every single skin tone. Like every single skin tone. This, ew, like I just love blush. It just brings life to your face. And it's just a staple in your makeup routine that I feel like everybody needs. And I feel like this NARS Orgasm, you will not go wrong. Like it's very popular right now. And, oh my God, it's just so freaking pretty. Like, I swear to you, this will look good on any skin tone. Any skin tone. Even though I don't use highlight right now, it gives you like a little bit of highlight. It's a little bit of shimmer in here. So it's like the perfect highlight for me, um, just because I don't use highlight. 
Mm, so pretty. Mm, I look crazy smiling like that. <laughs> Let's get a close up of this face though. So to end it off with a lip, I'm going to, I just lined my lips with a brown liner and then I am going to use the Charlotte Tilbury um, Pillow Talk. I put it back in the case because the case is just so cute and I love the packaging on these little lipstick things. Um, this is the Charlotte Tilbury's mini lip wardrobe. I've been using Pillow Talk. Um, I'm going to take it out for you and I love that this comes in a variety of colors just so you can, you know, switch it up and but the one that i've been loving is pillow talk where is that it's like this perfect nude color i feel like it looks good on everybody so this is what it looks like just a little cute little compact lipstick this nude perfect Oh my god. This is the perfect nude jaw. Perfect. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. And it's so moisturizing to lip. Like I just love it. Like I just ugh, I just can't get enough of this. Mm, so cute. Okay, y'all. Oh, I just love my makeup. So let me get dressed and then we're gonna get into perfume like always, okay? Then <laughs> to end off this video for perfume, I'm going to be using the new Tom Ford Bitter Peach. This is a sexy peach. I absolutely love this thing. I've been using it every day since I got it. So, and y'all know I do not see y'all wrong when it comes to scent. So please, please, please go pick this up. This is literally like the best freaking, like I don't like fruity scents, but this is a sexy, sophisticated peach scent. So, oh my God, this is very, very grown peach. Like, oh my God, y'all. I just can't. It's just so sexy and just, ugh, I just love it. So make sure y'all go try, try this out because it's so good like so good mm. oh my god I smell so good <laughs> so all right y'all that is it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed do not forget to like comment and subscribe and let me know which products are yo you guys are going to snag from Sephora y'all like my face has never looked this good so uh, oh my god like I'm so happy right now all right, y'all, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe and let me know which items you are gonna pick up. All the um, items that I used in the video will be listed down below. So do not forget to check them out. And I love y'all so much. And thank you, Sephora, for sponsoring this video. Without y'all, these opportunities wouldn't be happening. So thank y'all so much. So, but anyways, y'all, I love y'all so much. And I'll see y'all next video. And slay your face. But yeah, y'all, I love y'all so much. And I'll see y'all next video. Bye.